welcome to Just Pause. We show up as we are. That's the only requirement when it comes to the practice of meditation from the yoga perspective. We can't fix or change or it doesn't do any good to ignore or deny the state of our being. But the practice of meditation from the yoga perspective begins by having the intention of pausing to just notice. And it's in that noticing that we learn to listen again, to hear again the state of our body, the state of our emotional relationship with what is with the world. So I'm going to kind of blend a couple of techniques in our meditation today. And the first of which is, of course, always going to be, can I ground in my posture? Can I center on my breath? And that's enough. Now, at first, our mind might be pinging all over the place. And that's why I'm going to use a poem to help us meditate, help us focus our attention. If you would prefer to recite a mantra or even do some gentle, simple touch that helps to connect the mind to the body in this moment, that's another strategy to help you stay in the moment. After I read the poem, then I'm going to guide you through essentially a mindfulness conversation with your body. Take you through the parts of your body and just greet them as the level of intimacy that you have with that part of your body. So you can think about it in the sense that when you greet a dear friend, you might give them a hug. Is there any parts of your body that are dear friends and you can embrace them in that gift of giving and receiving? Or a lot of times our, our social exposure is more like, I think I know you, right? And how many parts of the body are kind of like that? Like, I know you're part of me, but I don't really know you. So the idea is, can we open up that dialogue so that we can know ourselves better. And why is that important? So that we can respond to our life with intention. When we know what we feel, when we know what we know, we can advocate for ourselves, we can ask for what we need, and we can also articulate what our perspective is so that we can cultivate more alignment with the world around us. It also gives us a chance to check in on our capacity so that we can know how much is too much before it becomes too much. So with that said, welcome to Just Pause. find a comfortable position whether that's reclined or upright the idea is take the work out of the body so that you can travel in to the mind and the spirit this is a poem from Tracy Dominic James entitled one breath feel this breath as it enters ideally through the nose and as it exits again Ideally, through the nose. Breath is the only requirement for life, and really the only requirement for coming to this moment more fully. With one breath, I hold myself in this moment. On the finest edge of a deep inhale, born of sturdy blood and bone, I set my bow. I wait for the debris and dust to settle. I wait for the drumbeat to slow. I wait for the tangled howl of the insatiable world to give way to a gossamer whisper. I wait for the chaos to order. On the edge of this pulsating breath, the rhythm of my matrix sets my course for one point ahead, and I wait. Fear, be gone from me. Doubt, lay down your sword. 
Your tongues are coarse, your murmurings deceptive. I spring from a more vital language. I understand now who I am. I am neither the debris nor the dust. I am neither the drum nor the howl. I am neither the chaos nor the order. I am the branch that will bend without breaking. I am the sigh of the stretching string. I am but the moment and the breath. They are all and everything. And on the edge of that moment, I draw back the bow string, reach bravely forward towards life, and let that one breath go. Feel your right foot, big toe, the second toe, third toe, fourth toe, and little toe. The sole of the foot, the top of the foot. Feel and greet your foot. Say hello to your right foot. Your left foot, the big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, little toe, the sole of the foot, the top of the foot. Say hello to your left foot. Say hello to both feet. Greet your left ankle, left lower leg, left knee, left upper leg, the whole left leg. Say hello to your whole left leg. Feel your right ankle, right lower leg, right knee, right upper leg. Say hello to your right leg. Feel the entirety, the wholeness of your right leg. Feel both legs. Feel the right hip, the right ribs, the right shoulder blade, the right collarbone. Feel the whole right side of your torso and say hello. Feel the left hip, the left ribs, the left shoulder blade, the left collarbone. Say hello to the left side of your torso. Feel the whole of your torso, from pubic bone to tailbone, collarbone, and everything in between. Notice your right shoulder, 
upper arm, elbow, lower arm, and wrist. Feel the back of your hand, the palm of your hand, the thumb, index, middle, ring, and pinky fingers. Feel the whole right arm. Say hello to your right arm. The left shoulder, the left upper arm, elbow, the lower arm, the wrists, the back of the hand, the palm of the hand, left thumb, index, middle, ring, and pinky finger. Feel the whole left arm. Say hello. Greet the left arm. Feel both arms. Feel the right side of the occiput at the base of the skull. Feel your right jaw, your right ear, your right cheeks, your right eye, your right eyelid, your right side of your forehead. Feel the right side of your head and say hello. Feel the left occiput, the base of the skull on the back, your left jaw, left ear, left temple, eye, eyelid, eyebrow, forehead. Feel the whole of your head. the lips, the teeth, and the tongue. Feel your face and swallow. Bring your attention and say hello to your heart. the whole body. Say hello to you, just as you are. Ask the body, what do you need? How can I support you? How can I love you? The simplest answer is to just breathe. Anything more is just you listening more deeply, experimenting, playing, and honoring this relationship, not only with you, but with the divine spark within you, the Atman Center. Take three breaths to connect with that sense of the divine spark, that pure and innocent, perfect, if you will, unscathed energy, the Atman Center. To 
take one final exaggerated large breath, inhaling, maybe sighing out, exhaling. <sighs> And then bringing the hands to your heart center when you are ready to close this pause. Notice what you notice about the state of your body, your mind, your breath. This is the beginning of you better knowing you. And that is the gift of meditation and yoga is the means. May you breathe deeply and move freely, labor lovingly, and live vibrantly. May you be well. Namaste. Thank you so much for sharing this practice with me, and I look forward to seeing you next time and uh, hearing your questions or your comments on how it feels to embody your being and to invite this dialogue, this conversation, that as a child, we were all fluent, but as adults, we've often turned down the volume of that fluency and forgotten how to even notice what we feel, where we feel it, and what we want to do with that information. Take care.